Well, health matters, and during a vote in the Louisiana legislative session, State Senator John Milkovich made some alarming comments which don't line up with scientific evidence regarding vaccines and autism. NBC6's Alexandra Meacham breaks it down for us. Before voting against a bill regarding an immunization database, Senator John Milkovich made this comment. There is a very contentious scientific debate that's going on right now in America and has been for decades and the features of which are becoming more and more public every day in which many are saying that these vaccinations pose danger. For example, when Senator Lambert and I were growing up, autism did not exist. Many of you may know that some of the leading researchers in America say that autism is a result of vaccination. Autism was first described by psychiatrist Lee O'Connor in 1944. Local health care experts say autism has always existed in human populations. It's just better identified and diagnosed now. In about the year 2000, one in 150 children were diagnosed with autism. Um, as of this year, about one in 68 children are diagnosed with autism. So it isn't that, um, that the vaccines are causing, you know, this. I think it's, we've just gone from a very small, you know, criteria of what is autism to a larger spectrum. Senator Milkovich went on to make further comments, which have long been scientifically studied and refuted. Vaccines in America are preserved often with uh, mercury which is beyond neurotoxic. Fortenberry says Milkovich was referring to a preservative used in making vaccines called thermerosol, which was removed from all vaccines in 2001. I would just ask for proof of where that information came from. I think that's the most important thing is if you ever speak out about something, just to know what you're talking about. Fortenberry says the anti-vax movement has led to an increase in measles cases, which was declared eradicated in 2000, but last year saw 700 cases across the country. Now, as Alexandra Meacham reporting, the CDC encourages all parents to vaccinate their children and speak with your doctor if you have any concerns.